We've been sitting in the den now for quite some time. Cheyenne knows there's something wrong, and she's reluctant to come into the den area, I and mean, Helen's getting really agitated. I don't do claustrophobia. You know, I just don't like feeling in a tight, confined space. It's such a crucial stage. If Cheyenne doesn't come in in a moment and accept food from Helen, her goal of being a nanny and ultimately joining the pack could be over very, very quickly. We've got to try and convince her that it's acceptable for having two pack members in here with her, yeah. where normally this would be a very solitary moment for her. Absolutely. Well, just as I'm thinking she's not going to come in, she suddenly rushes in. <laughs> nice and slowly, nice and gently. You've got this wolf, you know, constantly biting around your lips and your mouth ferocious to get the food out. She's asking for more food. It's terrifying. Early signs were, were fantastic, really. The way she was with Helen, you know, desperately asking Helen for food, responded to the call. So, yeah, big plus, big plus. Oh, oh excuse me. <coughs> yeah. You're regurgitated regurgitated liver. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Would you like some, dear? <laughs> it's tempting, but no. I have to say. <laughs>